to another vlog. Today is so exciting because we are officially starting the home buying process. Today's the home inspection, so I'm going with Halo right now to meet the home inspector and my real estate agent. Um, Sam has to work, so I gotta go do this all on my own. You guys, I've done so much stuff on my own. I've got homeowner's insurance. Um, quotes. I've signed so many papers. I've done so many things. I'm gonna be doing the appraisal. Well, not me, but like, you know, being there. But honestly, it's so much fun. And what's so insane is like I told you guys, I'm literally a real estate agent. I'm <laughs> licensed in Arizona. I've only sold one house, which is my parents' house. Oh, Chick-fil-A. I think I'm gonna get a Cobb salad from Chick-fil-A for lunch. I keep seeing that on my TikTok and it looks so good. I normally get the kale crunch salad with the buffalo and ranch sauce and like mix in the um, chickens, but I think I really want like a cob salad with some ranch dressing. So off topic, but yeah, I'm on my way to the inspection and I'm excited to go see the house again. So the house is a new build, it's like new construction and it's not even in the GPS yet. Like whenever I typed in the address, it doesn't take me there. So I'm literally going off of my own brain cells right now to try to remember how to get there because I know the general area, I just don't know like the turns and stuff. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, I'm a real estate agent. I've done it, I've passed the test. I've put in literally thousands of hours and dollars <laughs> to become a real estate agent. And my silly little self feels like I've learned more by experiencing the process hands on as a home buyer than I did being an agent, which is so crazy. You guys know what's so, 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 so crazy is Halo was conceived in Louisiana. Literally the day we got back from our honeymoon, we conceived Halo. <laughs> in our Louisiana apartment, who remembers when we used to live there on an air mattress? Halo was conceived on an air mattress. Two miles that way. Our first home that we're buying is two miles from where Halo was conceived, which is so cute. And this baby, I figured it out, was conceived in Las Vegas. <laughs> when we went there for the UFC fights, that's where that baby was conceived. So that's cute and fun. Okay, we're pulling up on the house. I'm so excited. Okay, so I just met with the builder and the inspector literally just got there because I thought I had to be there at 12, but I guess I have to wait until the inspection's over, so. I am gonna go to Chick-fil-A and get myself some Chick-fil-A. What is this, charred tomato crispy red bell pepper? Oh my gosh. Slay Chick-fil-A. That sounds so good. Okay, I just need the salad in my stomach right now. So hungry. Because we're at Target. I'm gonna go in here and get some essentials for the house. We have a TV and we have mattresses, but that's about it. I also look, I feel like I'm going through it though. Um, I need my hair done, I need my nails done. I need a tan. Okay, so yes, we bought a new house. I'm at Target right now. I've been running so many errands. You guys, you have no idea. I am so tired. Like I cannot get rested. The house is gonna take probably another two weeks until it's finished and like put together. My goal is to have everything ready in the house like ready for a house tour by the time i go to phoenix like before i go my brother's fighting on march 9th and we're gonna be going to phoenix for that so that's my goal to have everything by that time but i will show you guys a little sneak peek i was gonna do an empty house tour but i just never did we just honestly got so excited and started bringing stuff in so there's little bits of stuff in there so i guess when we go home i can show you guys like what we have so far show you our fridge and all that kind of stuff because we're so excited it's two o'clock right now my mom's with halo she came into town a couple days ago so she got to see my house with FDD and some of the cutest things for Halo's bedroom. I'm going for like a pink, yellow, orange theme. So I got this shelf that's yellow. This is the cutest little lamp, oh my gosh. Still deciding on what comforter to get. I like this one because it's like reversible with the two different shades of pink. Love this little throw, gingham knit throw. And then this little pillow is so cute. I wish they had this in like a yellow color. This is for when we start potty training. Waterproof, anytime, anywhere pad, perfect. And then I'm deciding between these two sheets. I think I like this one more because it ties in like the yellow and pink. I guess that one does too. But they only have this in a full and I need a twin. So I think we'll do this one, even though that one is so cute. Maybe I'll come back and check for a backup sheet. <gasps> so cute. 
I got a full car from Target. Everything's for Halo's room, basically. <laughs> okay, we went to Home Goods. I also. What am I trying to say? <laughs> I also just went to Home Goods. I need to get home because I'm feeling quite the Lulu. Woo! It's so cold. I really want to go in Bath and Body Works. They have like the best scented soaps. Okay, no, because I need to come out to Baton Rouge tomorrow anyway. Okay, I'm going home. <laughs> Bye. one I feel like I can already tell that the quality just looks better I didn't do any settings or anything so hopefully the lighting's okay wait it looks better doesn't it sorry it's probably so echoey but yeah we got a house on the ground we still have the RV we're gonna keep it for whenever we travel and stuff like that we may trade it in in the future for like a smaller one because ours is just so big and it's like hard to haul everywhere but I did not want to show you guys the house until it was all done because I was like, I want to get all the furniture in here and make it super cute and like decorate it. But that's going to take me a minute to do, I realized quickly. So I know I like watching vlogs of people moving and like seeing kind of the process. I don't have like any big furniture in here. We just have like the basics so far. Mattress, stuff in the kitchen, and that's it. It's not big, but it's so so spacious compared to what I'm used to in the RV. It's honestly the perfect size for our starter home. All glory to God, he made all this happen for us so quickly and like smoothly in the process. This is what we have going on with Halo's room right now. It's an absolute disaster, but her, I got her a twin bed, okay? She's gonna be doing a big girl bed. It's in this box, the frame is, it is the cutest thing. I'm so excited. I literally am so excited because her bed is gonna be huge. I'm gonna put it here. I got this little nightstand from TJ Maxx yesterday. This lamp I got from Target, so cute. And I'm so funny. This is my first time doing any house things. And <laughs> I went to Target and I only got one panel for blinds. I didn't realize it only comes with one. Like that is so stupid. I, I didn't even check, honestly, but why would it only come with one? Who wants to put one panel up? And it was like $35, it was honestly kind of expensive. They're really good quality curtains though, but I also love her curtain rod. It has like the sunshine. And my favorite thing about this room is her little window seal. She goes up there, she plays, she reads her books. But yeah, all her clothes are just thrown in here with absolutely no rhyme or reason, but she has a nice big walk-in closet as well. The clothes make it look so much smaller than it is, but I gotta go through and hang all this. I gotta go get hangers. This room just is holding literally all my packages. I'll do a little haul for you guys. We got the security system to come in and do all the windows with motion detectors. The two bedrooms in the front are carpeted. They both have nice walk-in closets. Hi, sissy. I'm horsey. You're watching horsey with no couch. You're being a good girl. This is the living and kitchen area. So I'm so excited. The TV, let me address this. It looks like it's so low to the ground and it is, but we're gonna be getting one of those like consoles that go underneath like a long skinny one and it sticks out. So Halo won't be able to touch the TV. And the reason we did it is we actually watched a YouTube video and it says like so many people mount their TVs so high up when it's actually supposed to be eye level from whenever you're sitting on the couch. So we plan on putting our couch like at about here. And then when you're sitting down, it's eye level. When you stand up, it's obviously low, but this also has these type of ceilings and so does our bedroom. So I love just adds dimension and opens up the house, I feel like. Our room goes back there. This is just another storage closet. I love the windows. I'm gonna get a curtain and we're gonna do blinds and it's gonna be gorgeous. I got this plant from Target. I need to still like, you know, fix it up and juice it up. And then this is just our back door, back door to a patio. This is the trash can. I literally don't know where to put it. I honestly hate it, but all of our cabinets, that's one bummer are so small. So there's like nowhere for a trash can to fit in, like a big size one. I guess I could put it here maybe. Fridge we'll get to. Also, it's gonna be all matching one panel. This is the Samsung Bespoke interchangeable panel fridge. So you can actually interchange those. We went with the white glass. They were completely sold out and on back order until like middle of March for the all white. So we went with just the gray on the bottom, but they're gonna come in and switch it out for us. Not sponsored whatsoever, but I'm going to sell you on this because it's absolutely insane. 
So we have the family hub, that's what they call it right here. Hello. It has a camera so you can see what's inside your fridge and it's not organized yet, so don't come for me. But whenever you're, like you attach it to your app on your phone, when you're at the store and you're like, wait, do I need to get something? You just check your camera. The weather, hello, amazing. It has Bixby, which I need to set up basically like Alexa. Um, and then it has this, which is like the home setting. Oh wait, it thinks I'm talking to it. Cancel, okay, or not. Um, it tells the time, it's like blocked out right now. Cause Okay, there you go. It tells the time and the date, the weather. These you can change um, to like whatever picture you want. So you can like hook up your, I haven't done it yet, but you can hook up your gallery to it. Um, then you can have your calendar and set up your whole calendar in here and share events, that's amazing. This I need to change to three days. You could do little sticky notes, like how cute is this? Birthday. Ew, that's ugly. Okay, why can I not draw three, whatever. You could do videos, you can like touch it to see what you want like in front or whatever. Um, and then you could do Alexa, Amazon Essentials. What baby? Formula.com. I said the A word. Hold on. Iron is an essential baby nutrient for brain development and the formation of healthy blood cells. Oh, okay, thank you. Let's look at all these apps. I'm not gonna go through them, but you can stream Spotify. You can hook your ring camera up. So our ring camera on our front door, I can see who's at the front door from my fridge. Like that's insane. You could do um a look at this, the cooking. It like gives you recipes and stuff. You have to hook it up to your whisk account. I have to like hook all those up. A meal planner. You do your TV, your to-do list is on here. I have like to buy for the house still. Insane, amazing. Watch TV, Pandora. Like I said, Spotify. You can do all your apps right here. This is like just the most insane thing. So that's all of the family hub. And there's so much more to it too, but I just, you know, haven't set anything up. What is this child doing? Okay, so let's go inside. Like I said, this is not organized whatsoever, okay? This is actually a mess, so wait until you see me organize this. Oh, I forgot I have coffee. Oh, Soleil, I got a ice flat white with pistachio cream cold foam. So freaking good. I need to add some ice to it though, because the ice melted. Okay, so yeah, fridge. This is actually a better look at it. So it has the doors. Halo, mommy's showing them something. It has the doors. I'm gonna organize this to no extent. Like I'm so excited for the fridge organization, but it has like a crisper for your fruits and vegetables. The water filter goes here. And then this will be like Sam's meat drawer and stuff. Cause he like literally makes a ribeye every single night. He buys this like $300 steak from Costco. Um, this right here will have all the beverages because it has a built in, let me close it. Watch out. Sauces will all go on that side because look, beverages are all gonna go right here. So when you open, this is the beverage center. This is my favorite part. This is what sold me. So, oh my gosh. You can just quickly grab your beverages and this is like a separate opening. You could put infused water, filtered, ready to go, automatically refills right here. I have lemons in there right now. I'm gonna make some spa water next. So maybe like some lavender and some cucumber lemon, like, okay, slay. And then this right here, it's a little frosty, but this, you could just go and get some regular filtered water. Absolutely amazing. Watch your head, baby. And then this is the freezer. I don't even think we have anything in here, honestly. Oh, just my unreals. <laughs> so good. Double decker fridge with the slide. Dun, 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 dun. Scooper comes in this and it makes two kinds of ice. <gasps> the pebble ice. I mean, it's not like, I guess, nugget, but it's kind of close. You can take a piece of this one. Take a piece of the little one. That one's too big. Here. Halo loves ice. Here. And then the big ice. So two different kinds of ice. I'm fully obsessed like this is the fridge of my dreams and like i said we're gonna get this matched with the top so it's gonna be all this white glass it's stunning i never thought i would want a white refrigerator but it turns out it's a sleigh you want a snack do you want your crunchies yeah okay here 
and Sam's. We have a mattress in here that we've been sleeping on. But <laughs> literally, we don't even have our comforter out. He's so mad. He's like, can we just please sleep with our comforter? And I'm like, no, not until we get our bed frame. Because I want it to be like new. So don't look at that. I also get my own closet in this house. It is absolutely tornado disaster in here. So don't mind it. But just for size reference, she's nice and large. She goes like back there too. Pretty decent bit. So much space to hang my clothes. Nothing's organized. The floor looks like it threw up, but that's my closet. And then I don't have to share with my husband anymore. He has his own. And I'm embarrassed to show you this because his is actually like semi-organized. He hung all his up, but what's this disaster, you know? And then we have this nice little area. Bathroom's a mess. Also spilled blush, or no, not me, Halo spilled blush on the new carpet already, but it's fine. I gotta wait for my vacuum to come in the mail to fix that up. So here's the bathroom. I am not crazy about the bathroom. I love every single thing about this house. This bathroom is like my least favorite part of the house, but it's still freaking amazing compared to what we had. And I'm so grateful. So I have the double mirrors. I like the light fixtures. I think those are cute. I like how everything's black. Big, big, big bathtub, which hallelujah, I already got my bath pillow in here. I need to get a bath caddy. I need to do the whole thing, the candles. I love the tiling around. It just like adds that extra. Halo's been bathing in here though, so we need to get them toys out of there. I don't like the layout of this bath. Like I feel like it's just like pushed back there. Um, This area, not crazy about, but the shower's kind of small. It's okay though. I don't want to complain at all. <laughs> What we might do, my dad was talking about this, is like close this off so that it's like um, a private bathroom, you know? Have like a door there and then move this out because there's so much space right here that we honestly don't need. Like what are we gonna do with this whole space, you know? Especially if this is closed off, we won't need like any walking area. And then move this out, extend it, put a double shower head in and then close it with glass. So that might be a project that we look into. And I'm not crazy about the placement of the bathtub, but that's gonna have to stay. I can deal. And I don't know, do I like the double mirror? I can't figure out if I like the double mirror or if I'd rather have one big one. We still need to get a bed frame. We need to get, for our room, we need to get um, a desk for like office space. We need to get a couch, a dining room table, and like a whole dining room set. Oh, you can't figure out how to open it? Here, let me get it. Um, a whole dining room set. We need to get rugs for my room, the living room. Can I say hi? Hi. You look right here. Say hi. Hi. Say I love you. Hello. <laughs> say I'm watching horsies. <laughs> and I'm eating a snack. <laughs> say cheese pops. Cheese pop. <laughs> What's your name? Yellow. And how old are you? Mama. Mama, yeah, how old are you? Doctor. See, I'm gonna be two in three days. Oh my goodness, I can't believe that. We need to, we need to chat. We have so much stuff that you guys on. I cannot believe that my daughter is going to be two. Um, but yeah, we need a rug, we need like a coffee table. I already ordered, like I said, this stand right here. Oh, also let me know what you think about maybe getting like an island put in right here. Let me do a quick little rapid fire haul. This is gonna be like so random and out of order. For Halo's bathroom, this bath rug. Out of these little towels. I got her these big towels. For her toys, her bath toys, this like suctions onto the corner of the tub. And then I got her this shower curtain that matches perfectly. Oh, this is the other panel that I had to go get for her curtains. But these curtains are so beautiful. I got them from Home Goods for 40 bucks. Comes with two panels. See, like this comes with two panels. It just makes sense. But I love the material of this. It's so gorgeous. And then it'll look like this. Nice, airy, breezy for our living room. Oh, this is for me and Sam's bathroom. I love these. They're so aesthetic and cool. And I just love the texture of it. The toothbrush holder and the soap dispenser. And then I got a tray. How gorgeous is this tray? Like, can you guys even see the detail of it? Is my camera picking up? I don't know, because I'm too far away. And it's so pretty. And then I got Halo pillow. 
She just needs one. Um, I got this for me and Sam. This is the Threshold brand from Target. Feather and Down Comforter. This is like our little duvet insert. And then our duvet. It's hard to see. I loved the color though. It's like such a nice rich color. And Sam, I, I love white. I love cream. I love oatmeal. I love beige. But Sam gets it so dirty. Because even though he scrubs his body in the shower, he still just has man on him so i got this color which is like a grayish tan beige yeah, clothes and it's like a duvet cover I got this color sheets which i might return because i could have swore when i ordered on amazon i'm honestly obsessed with it i wish i could find sheets that color or would it be okay to have we'll see but this is like the ugh oasis technology i got this i honestly hate it now and i don't think it goes with the vibe anymore but it was just like a runner rug for the entryway, but I think it's too small and I also don't like how it feels. But, oh, this has nothing to do with the house, but I got Halo pair of jeans from the Cat and Jack brand. I love this brand from Target and these are so cute. She needs new jeans that actually fit her. Her jeans are so tight, but they have little embroidered flowers all over them and I like the wash of these. I thought it was cute. And then this was freaking adorable in the dollar section and it makes paw prints. From the Easter Bunny. Okay, we got this cheap little toaster. I'm not gonna splurge on a toaster when we spent lots of money on our fridge. We splurged there. Um, this is just the Threshold brand paper towel holder. And this is just from Amazon and it's a organizing. And guys, I have so many more packages to come, so I'm probably not gonna show you guys everything that I get, obviously, because it would be insane, but maybe we'll get some more hauls. And I can also just like go around and show you instead of hauling it, just like show you it when the house is done. But I got a three pack of these for Q-tips, cotton balls, like whatever flossers for our bathroom. And then I got this knife set, which Sam hates, but I will use. He once got his own knife set, whatever, but this one was aesthetic and cute. And it comes with the measuring cups, which I didn't even know, slay. And then these knives and this knife holder, beautiful. And it's like a diamond plate design. I need to clean all this up. I need to start hanging up my clothes. Me and Sam are gonna go furniture shopping. When I go pick them up from work today, my mom's gonna watch Halo. And we're getting burgers tonight from Five Guys. And I'm so excited because their burgers are so good. I hadn't had one in years, like, cause I was vegan for so long. And then my dad took me and Halo the other day. We were hanging out and Oh my gosh, I have not been able to stop thinking about their burger, so. I love you. Oh wait, I never opened that box in there, which is, I think, pots and pans. I do need to go to the camper sale and get a few things. My blender, my air fryer, and like little appliances like that. My coffee espresso machine, coffee hooks. So on our coffee bar. They'll hang like that, and then if you can see, the mugs hang from it, and it's just so cute. Do you think they'll fall off of me? No. Okay. Oh, that's a sleigh. Look at that. Pots and pans. So it comes with, I think, eight pieces, and it's the brand Karote. Best value and aesthetic design. Detachable. Oh, yeah, this is why I love it so much, too. They have these refrigerator. Oh, this is another one. They have these refrigerator. That's why these are detachable. Savers, so you can literally cook your meal and then put this top on it. I've never seen anything like this. If this has been in existence, I didn't know. And then you can save your food with the actual pot. That is absolutely genius. I am fully exhausted right now. I just did talking for probably an hour straight. So I'm gonna go sit in silence and get some things done. I'm gonna do the closets and all this. But I wanted to show you guys everything in the house because I'm so excited. Still some stuff coming in like utensils and all that. No, I'm talking. You got chocolate on you? It's okay.
We're gonna do a little wrist action. I added some ice to my coffee. Have fun. Oh, it breaks my heart that she sits there. Go play with your toys in your room. You wanna watch? Okay. Not done, but progress. the next day so yesterday night me and Sam went and we finally got a couch and we got a dining table set so they're actually both so freaking nice I'm so excited and I can't wait to see them in here the only thing is that our dining room table is like a grayish color wood which I was really worried about but with this new build I'm gonna show you guys they actually have lots of pops of gray in the house that I didn't even remember or recognize. Pops of gray in the tiling, like that's the door that goes out back. The window sills are also like this taupey gray color. It's kind of hard to see. They're like a taupey gray color. Me and Sam's bathroom, which we also looked at a bed frame. We ended up not getting it because we didn't love it, but um, it was also a grayish color. But this tiling in here, that up there is gray. So there's actually lots of pops of gray. Our dining room table is pretty big. It's gonna be able to seat eight people. It has a bed, I'll just show you guys. So we're gonna pick it up either today or tomorrow, depending on when Sam gets off work. We have to go pick it up at this warehouse that's like an hour and a half away. Because right now this is like our situation. We literally just sit on the floor. I'm about to do my Bible study with my friend Kaylee and I have to like sit on the floor and do it because I have no furniture. And then I need to go to Trader Joe's for just some um, necessities. I have so many recipes I wanna make. Anyways, I'm gonna make coffee. Using the Starbucks iced coffee, medium roast, and then just a splash of some almond milk. <gasps> Wait, I have to show you guys, I just remembered. First of all, she's absolutely stunning. Do we see this? Okay, oh my gosh, my camera's about to die. I come home last night from furniture shopping and my mom and dad built her bed. It's so stinking cute. I'm so obsessed. Ready, sis? Let's go. Okay, so I was craving a sandwich and my mom got this for her in Halo the last like two days that she watched her and it looks so good, so I wanna try it, but it's this place called Chicken Salad Chick. Got a little Ono Palmer. I need some rice. Got a broccoli salad as my side. It's so good, I tried some of my mom's yesterday. And then I got a chicken salad BLT. And my bread's not toasted. They normally toast it, but I asked for them not to. I, I I can't explain myself. Like, in any other life, I'd be like, no. It needs to be toasted. But lately, I've just been wanting cold sandwiches. So, it's like, bye. Mmm. It's so refreshing and good. The lettuce is crispy. Bacon's good. Chicken salad's good. They have, like, 100 different chicken salad flavors, too, but... I just went with regular. A pickle? Can your friends play with your giggy? Yeah, of course. Yay, Halo! My turn? Giggy's turn!
playing by myself at the park because my daughter doesn't want to play with me and she won't let my mom play with me. Okay, I'm getting nauseous. <laughs> 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 <laughs>